This this is why I don't have you help me, Cat Phantom, with videos because let me make it bigger. Because I can't fucking read it. I'm a professional. Oh, I've worked with Cal before, <laughs> I know. Don't do these 25, 25 wacky questions. They were asking sure. each other. Do you... Tell me a dick. <laughs> All right, so what's one, what's one fun fact that very few people know about you? I guess people on my channel. Right. Yeah. So. You, you haven't been on my channel, but you were on Lisa's channel. That's true. Um, I grew up in a farm. Mm, I grew true. up as a farm boy. You're a farm boy. Are we supposed to each do the question? Did they each do the question? Yes. What would you do first if you were invisible for a day? Are we going back and forth? I think that would make the most sense. What did they do? I'm gonna ask Lisa. We're gonna do our own thing. No, I'm gonna ask Lisa. I feel like going one and then the other is better content. I mean, okay. I don't mean to judge. I don't do this for a living. I mean, I kind of yeah, do. Yeah, you do. <laughs> but from that side of the camera, not this side. Okay, so you wanna just go back and forth? Yes. Okay. So what would you do first if you were invisible for a day? Tucker is like mowing on a bone over there. Um, what would I do first if I were invisible for a day? These are weird ass questions. Peggy, these are weird ass questions. Um, I have no fucking clue what I would do if I was invisible for a day. Holy shit, I'm invisible. Holy shit, I'm invisible. This is exciting content, folks. Thank you for sticking around. <laughs> Don't be a dick. <laughs> okay, what would I do if I was invisible for a day? For reals, I don't know what I would do. What would you do if you were invisible for a day? If I were invisible, well, the first thing I would do is go, why am I invisible? And then I would try to figure, like any good superhero, you've just been gained a power. You need to figure out how you got that power and how to replicate it and control it. Okay, so see, my mind went more <laughs> to the super villain. I am invisible. What havoc could I cause? Well, that's fine. With that. But you need to be able to replicate it as a good villain too. I mean, you're not wrong. Okay, so are you are you secretly a superhero or a super villain? Probably the anti-hero. You are the anti-hero, yep. I would be a hero, but not Superman style. It would be... Batman. Yeah, yeah, I do like my toys, so mm -hmm. yeah. It's yeah, probably more of a Batman. You have a, fucking, you have a whole garage full of mm -hmm. Batman toys. Fair, fair. Uh, I'd be a villain just in case you were wondering. Yeah, I know. <laughs> There's a zombie apocalypse. What skill will you to use <laughs> to survive it? We've already had this discussion. I'm not going to survive no. a zombie apocalypse. No, you're not. All I ask is that you make sure my kids are taken care of. And if you need to like, you know. I'm gonna be honest, the kids are okay, not well, much better off. I'll be that's, fine. That's true, you will be fine. Like Mr. Survival will be fine. But um, what skill would I have to use to survive? I wouldn't survive a zombie apocalypse. I could stab something. <laughs> that would be my skill. I guess stabby stabby. Okay. Okay. So, what do you want to be in your next life? In my next life? Yeah. Mm. I mean, if you if you actually subscribe to that thought, which I know you don't, so. But it's okay. No, if you no, had a fine. next life, it's what? Fine. Well, what you want next to life doesn't mean next afterlife either. It does could mean like, what is my next thing? Okay, you went to such a dude place with that. Oh, <laughs> I'm sorry. My apologies. <laughs> Um, next life. In my next life. Yeah. Play within the context of my sandbox here. Okay, okay. fine. Next life. Next life. Mm -hmm. I want to be a sheep in Scotland. Just, <laughs> just hanging out. You want getting... to be a sheep in Yeah! What? This is probably the best life. It's like, I'm in Scotland, it's beautiful, I'm eating You're gonna grass, be a sheep. and okay. yeah, I'm getting trimmed all the time. I'm good. I'm not gonna kill. I'm just gonna wander around the fields. It's gonna be beautiful. <laughs> okay, you're gonna be a sheep in your You want to play in your sandbox. I'm playing play in my sandbox. sandbox. Okay, be in my sandbox. Oh my goodness. You're gonna be a sheep. Sure. Okay. In Scotland. In Scotland. Okay, so... Like yes. a Shetland sheep. Yeah, of course. Okay. Yeah, I want to be in a nice area. You don't want to be human again. Well, why? I don't know. I want to be an alien. Like, if I am going to get reincarnated, I want to be reincarnated on another planet. Why are you giving me shit planet. about being a sheep and you're saying you're <laughs> be an alien? 
I just want to be on a different planet. But here's the, here's the thing. I won't know that I'm on a different planet, so I won't know that I'm an alien. So like, just like you won't know that you used to be human and you're now a sheep. I'd still be happy as a sheep. Okay. <laughs> All right. Kevin's going to be a sheep in his next life. Cool, cool. Don't ask questions you don't want the answer to. <laughs> you won the lottery. Will you keep your job? Why or why not? Oh, that's funny. Well, yeah, because like this is my job, so absolutely keep my job. But if I won the lottery, then I could go like do my job all over the place all the time. Mm -hmm. And you could quit your job. I would never quit my job. I know you would be so bored if you quit your job. But I would may have another job, but yeah, I have to do something. I know. You can fix motorcycles. Mm -hmm. I could travel around, do this. And you could just fix motorcycles. And I would buy a house on the beach. Absolutely. If I won the lottery. Okay. What fun thing did you do this week? <laughs> what fun thing did I do this week? Yeah. Uh, well, technically Sunday was fun. And I was at the One Moto Show. Oh, yeah. We were at the One Moto Show. That's true. Uh, that, volunteering. Does that count as this week? It's a Sunday, yes. It's only Saturday. Not in my, we're in my sandbox, not in my world, but okay, I'll let that pass because that was, that was fun. Yeah. Sunday to Saturday, it's the week. Okay. My week starts on Monday. Yeah. But Sunday we went to the Wet Moto Show. Yes. Was that Sunday? Well, no, Saturday we went to it. Sunday I volunteered. For oh, that's right, because Sunday I was, what was I doing Sunday? You were working. I was working. And playing. And playing. Yeah. Okay. That's my, that's my every Sunday, I guess. Mm -hmm. That's true, you were. You volunteered all day long. What'd you do at the One Moto Show? On Sunday specifically? On Sunday specifically. Uh, a lot of uh, traffic direction. I played traffic cop. <laughs> it cracks me up that you and Curtis are like executive creative directors out mm -hmm. there directing traffic. It's okay. I don't it's mind. Just, it's just funny. I know you guys don't mind, but it's just funny. It's funny to me. Mm. Big fancy job title, directing traffic. It's funny. It's fine. Uh, farm boy. How many times do you hit the snooze button before getting up? I don't because I don't have a, an alarm, so therefore I don't have a snooze button. I get up whenever I want to get up. True. Although most times she does beat me up. Yeah. I'm usually up first. But that's just I have things to do. And I'm trying to do things before everybody else is up when it's actually quiet in the house. Mm -hmm. So I can, you know, hear myself think. So, good morning or don't talk to me until the coffee starts working? Uh, good morning. Because I have to. Well, that's true. <laughs> that's true. You're in meetings, like, before most people are even up. Yes, so. yes. But, yeah. Coffee always helps. Mm -hmm. But I'm still good morning. All right. Uh, what's your favorite thing right now? Uh, duh. What's my favorite thing right now? Fucking Baldur's Gate 3 with Did, my bestie. Didn't see that one coming. Spider, kill it. Run or panic until a true hero comes and vanquishes it for you. None of the above. It's a spider. <laughs> spiders are great, folks. I mean, spiders eat everything else. They, yes, they make little cobwebs everywhere, spiders, but they kill the annoying flies. Spiders are great, but like, that's that would be a better question for me, because if I see a spider, I just make you come get it. There's or no, the kids. Leave the spider alone. No. They'll go back to I what mean, doing. sometimes I do. Like, there's a spider that lives in my bathtub, and we have an arrangement. If it stays away from me, I stay away from it. Same. There's also the actual spider that lives in the kids' room, which is disgusting. Oh, well, tarantula? Yeah. yeah it's just a... It's a big long... hairy rock. Yeah. She's gross. She don't care. She's just sitting there. I know. She's gross, though. What food could you eat every day for the rest of your life? Coffee. <laughs> this is like, that's food. That's food to me. That is a meal to me. Coffee is a meal. It's valid. I'm going to stand by that answer. All right. We're going to talk to a different nutritionist here. <laughs> At some point, to say coffee is not a food. <laughs> coffee is definitely a food. It's absolutely it's a beverage. It it's is. A, it is hot water that's flavored. It's a meal. It is not a meal. It's breakfast. No. It's very often breakfast. No. Um. Okay. So real food. Real food. You just had it. Well, that's like a. That's that's just a. That's a whole meal. No, you had the dessert. Oh uh, yeah, you did take me to get creme brulee today. 
I do like crème brûlée. It's because I can actually eat it. Mm -hmm. It's a thing. Anyway, what kind of music do you like? You know, um, I do love me some 80s hair bands. I'd love to see some 90s grunge. Mm -hmm. uh, and I like, uh, I actually like a little bit of uh, bluegrass and country. So I'm all over the place. We listen to a lot of different music. We played, uh, what did we play when Lisa and Peggy were here? We played, where you throw on random music. Oh, I do like the random game. Yeah, when we throw on the random music. Unfortunately, the latest um, subscription services don't really play random very well. They, they kind of get stuck in Are we in, in Spotify again? Okay, seriously. Like, it's not just Spotify, it's all of them. I've tried them all. I've tried them saying. all. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. <laughs> if you don't like the Spotify, don't fucking use it. No, I Spotify's fine when I like a little switch, and YouTube's fine when I like a little different switch, and it's there's just no true random anymore. Like I no. want something to throw me a random. Like you know, I would never expect me to hear that ever, but they listen to what I like, and I like I want a true random. Mm -hmm. They don't exist. Yeah, because most people don't want weird ass shit in their music. I, I know do. you do. I know All you do. It. But I'm like in the boat of I want my favorite songs to just keep playing, which is why mm. I just play list with the smart shuffle, throws a few things in there. It's perfect. It's no hunter to CD changer though, like we used to have, so Yeah, that was amazing. It was amazing. It was revolutionary at the time. With the big book. We still have the book. Oh, that's true. It does are there CDs in there? The CDs are in the book. Now. Oh my goodness. So somewhere there's the big book of a hundred CDs. With the CDs in it. With the CDs in it. That's funny. If they haven't melted in the attic now. Do we, do we even have anything to play a CD anymore? Well, the PlayStation. The PlayStation? Your, oh, no, your car. The truck. The old truck. Oh, the old truck. The, the RV truck has a CD player in it. That's true. Mm -hmm. That's funny. Uh, pool or beach? Oh, it's a good thing you didn't get that question. <laughs> um, Kevin's a gremlin and doesn't like water. Not a lot. Mm -hmm. um, oh. Beach is fun. It's land. That's true. Beach is land. That's true. Uh, definitely beach. I mean, I like pool, but beach. Beach mm -hmm. is best. Well, this is a big question. What life or personal goals are you still working on? Mm. Getting a motorcycle to run. <laughs> that's an everyday <laughs> I know. There's that's four, an everyday There's three fight. or four or five of them out there that aren't running yet. It's not a life or personal goal. Mm -hmm. um, I think a personal goal to me is to see more of the world. Mm -hmm. um, you know, being Child. a farm boy from Indiana, never left Indiana until I moved here. So I have been to Europe a couple times. That's basically it. So I would like to experience all the countries and learn more about the cultures and See what's out there. Cool, let's go. <laughs> <laughs> uh, is the glass half full or half empty? Uh, it depends on the day and my mood. Wow. Yeah. You took a question that is either you're optimist or pessimist, and you said neither. <laughs> I see what you did there. <laughs> it depends on my mood. Some days it's half full, some days it's half empty, some days it's fallen over and spilled everywhere. Okay. That's my answer. I'm sticking by it. All right. Sticking by it. Um, okay, you just farted. Own it. That's a Peggy question. That's absolutely a Peggy question. Do you own it, apologize, or blame the dog? <laughs> it's easy to blame the dog because he stinks a lot. It's true, but he has a very unique smell. I would just own so, it. Yeah. Or ignore it. Because it happened. <laughs> it's life. Oh my goodness. Uh, you blame the dog, a <laughs> follow-up question, which is weird which to is go weird. off. Well, because we're not both answering the question, That's, see, because oh. you wanted to play by the wrong rules, so. Oh, we were supposed to, but, oh, I see. It's fine, it's That's fine. fine. Let's make a short video. That's not necessarily a good thing. Oh, well, we, we've kind of been answering them both anyway. I, That's true. All right, well, what would you do then? If there's no dog, I'd just own it. Okay. But if you blame the dog, problem is there's no dog now what? Well, That's what I said. We both would just own it. So we'd, we'd both would just own it. 
We have been married far too long to not just own it, so. True. Okay. But now that I've just learned the real rules. It's fine. <laughs> I tried to tell you the real rules and you said no, we were going to do it our own way. So we are doing it our own way. But you've been answering all the questions anyway. Because I, that's what I do. Yeah, yeah. Sorry. It's my sandbox. You got there. I got it. <laughs> For fuck's sake. Okay. It's hot in here. 19. <laughs> um, am I asking you? Yes. Okay, your smartphone breaks and you can't get it fixed for at least a week. How screwed are you? I don't care. I know you don't care. That was a terrible question for you. I don't You're care. like, yay, my smartphone's broke. I've got a laptop, got I've got laptop teams, and, I've got yeah. people get a hold of me. It, it'll work out. Yeah, even when we're on vacation, like, people still get a hold of you. In the middle of the sand dunes. How do you do that? How do you do that? You take meetings in the middle of the sand dunes. Mm. Okay. What are you doing? If my phone breaks, oh, well, I mean, I feel like that question either needs like the caveat of you can't use other devices because that's a totally different scenario. If my phone breaks, no biggie, man. I got my laptop and my uh -huh. iPad and all that. But if all my devices weren't accessible to me. Glorious. Um, I would, I would miss all, I would miss all my peoples. Well, of course. I would miss all my peoples. You'll be back. Well, like when we go to the dunes for a week, we have no service. Mm -hmm. So I read and I write and I read a lot. That's what I would do. Aliens just landed. Fortunately, they're friendly. What's Good. the first question you want to ask? Can I come back with you wherever it is you came from? Can I, can I go? Can I see your ship? I ask lots of questions. I just want to leave. Take me somewhere else. I guess I would ask where they're from. That tracks. This is a funny one. Okay, I'm new to Earth. Explain tarot to me in five words. <laughs> <laughs> that is not fair for me. Seek your direction with cards. Okay, is that based on what you've seen me do? Oh, well. <laughs> What am I going to base it on? I'm just saying. Just saying. Um, I've made a sentence. You've made a sentence. Good job. <laughs> Let's see. Five words. Must be a haiku. Wait. We need more for a haiku. We need more. It's a personal growth mirror for reflection. Mm, that's better. Did I get it? Mm -hmm. I got it. You got it. Okay. Uh, um, I think we're both doing them now. But you can read fine. it. That's fine. Twist your arm. Make you do my silly video. The need for sleep has been cured. <laughs> what are you doing with the extra eight hours? <laughs> I am working. Yep. I am working. That's what I'm doing. Yes. I work all the time anyway. You do. What, do you, what would you be doing? I, boy, I don't know. I need more games, I think. You need more games. I mean, there's always room for more games. Or would you need more motorcycles too? Mm, those get frustrating. This is <laughs> the ones that are in there are already pissing you off. Mm. Text messages, L O L M I, right, R I T E, question mark, or proper senses only, please. Um, I prefer typing it out. I don't mind if someone does the full thing. Now, when the, the the kids get into the emojis and I have to kind of figure out what the hieroglyphics is. That <laughs> takes me a little longer. I don't appreciate that. I don't mind an end, like, you know, heart, kiss, whatever. But there is actually whole emoji conversations that I've seen and I, I don't know what's going on. So You're too old for that. I'm way too old for that. Okay. Emoji hieroglyph conversations. Mm -hmm. I like that. Okay. Yeah. I write in complete sentences most of the time. Unless it's just an LOL or... Well, you're right. That's true. Like, Ash likes to poke fun at me because, like, he wrote me a book. I'm like, I know, I'm sorry. Oh, I don't write a book. Hey, I can write a book. Favorite way to spend the day off? I think that was for you, but... What does it matter? You can ask me. Oh, did I? Fine, you can ask me. <laughs> What's your favorite way to spend the day off? <laughs> Playing my game. Okay, or reading. Or... Hanging out, watching shows, whatever. Hmm? We're really playing my games. Any game's fine. 
Any games fine? Any games fine. I just want to play games. Um, <laughs> anything that doesn't require me to be somewhere on a meeting or <laughs> have to do something is a good day off. Whether it's no, watching no shows meetings. or games or naps. Naps are great. You do Love like naps. to nap. 20-minute naps. Short naps. Short naps. You are the king of power naps. The power nap is a great thing. Yeah. I can't power nap. If I'm in a nap, I'm going to go to sleep. I'm just going to go nope. to sleep. I'm just nope. done. I'm going to bed. Work for a bit. I Play know. for a bit. Power nap. Get back up. Do it again. Yeah, that's true. You do do that. We're down to the last question. Last question. It says, say one nice thing about yourself. Hmm. I'm a big deal. <laughs> I one nice thing about myself. How about you? I'm a big deal. Oh, I see. Because that's what you're always saying to me. Yeah, you're a big deal. <laughs> okay. What's your one nice thing? Oh, that is your one nice thing? No, I'm asking you first. It shouldn't be this hard. It shouldn't be this hard. This is a thing. That's, it's so hard to have a thought about yourself that isn't layered with self-criticism beneath it. It's fair. Well, I'll have to go with my old faithful. What? Strong like Strong like bull. Like bull. <laughs> you are strong like bull. That is true. <laughs> oh my goodness. That's the one nice thing about myself now. I think so. I'm a hot mess. And I think that's a nice thing. Because mm -hmm. I enjoy being a hot mess. I'll give you that, yeah. Mm -hmm. That's fair. Mm -hmm. My hot mess is fun sometimes. Most times. I keep life interesting. As always. <laughs> okay. You are trouble. Dude. <laughs> <laughs> 26 years later and I'm still trouble. Cool, cool. Mm -hmm. Cool, cool. All right. We did the list. Okay. Lisa and Peggy will be happy. All right. Thank you for playing in my sandbox. Same. <laughs> it's not too bad here. It's not too bad here. Okay. Signing off. That's not how you do it. Oh, that's not how you do it. Sorry. How do you do it? I don't do know. It. You don't, you don't like, I don't do it when I do this kind of video. I'm just like, I usually say thanks for hanging out. I thank you for hanging out with me. I thank them for hanging out with us because this was bizarre, bizarre video to do. There's more questions, and there's another one. Okay, well, tune in next time for the other one. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. Okay. Uh, alrighty. Hit the end button. Hitting the end button.